Your weather authority, here's meteorologist Jacob Matthews. The sun is now starting to shine on Warren and the Erie Bay front. Quick fill weather camera showing a live shot of Warren right now. Things are looking pretty damp over there. We're still dealing with a few showers within that county, but things are starting to dry up a bit on the Country Fair weather camera. But still pretty damp on the roads, as you can see. Um, Erie Bay front is uh, dealing with pretty gusty conditions as well. You can see the camera shaking a little bit, and we're going to continue to see uh, high wind gusts for the rest of the day. This is happening as a cold front's continuing to move through Pennsylvania along with those uh, rain showers that are now dissipating over in Warren County. The cold front's now over on the eastern half of the state and is continuing to bring showers over in the eastern part of New York State as well as parts of Pennsylvania over in that area. But as of now, we are dealing with dry weather and we're going to see a nice, dry, pleasant weekend. Lots of sunshine and a slight warm up as well. As for now, we're dealing with temperatures in the 60s across Erie County. Some temperatures are still holding out in the upper 50s. Weather watchers in Edinburgh as well as Cory have uh, reported those temperatures. And we're going to continue to see temperatures slowly on the rise for today, but not a big rise. Temperatures are, are holding out in the low 60s in Crawford County, as well as the upper 50s over in Chandler's Valley. But we're only going to reach up to about the mid 60s later today. Dew points are also holding steady, mid to upper 50s. On the comfort scale, that's pretty comfortable, but still close to the actual temperature, so be aware of any fog on the roads. Like I mentioned before, the cold front is starting to move through eastern Pennsylvania as well as eastern New York State, still bringing that line of showers that we have seen last night into eastern New York and into the New England states. But this will be followed by a high pressure system that is now affecting the Midwest and is slowly moving into the Northeast. It will move into our area later today. But we're still dealing with uh, that cold front that is continuing to bring in gusty winds from the northwest, cooler arctic air for today, so temperatures are holding steady in the mid to upper 60s for this afternoon. And afterwards, we're going to see a slight uh, shift in the wind as well as high pressure building in, so sunshine for Saturday. Not a huge warm up, but we are still seeing the mid 70s. We're going to see a bigger warm up for Sunday though as the winds uh, start to shift even more from the south bringing in higher winds and warmer air as well. Not just sunshine, so we could see temperatures reaching the low 80s for Sunday. And looking at the uh, water temperature, 75 on the lake shore, but three to seven feet waves, so I would not recommend uh, going on boat rides. It's gonna look pretty rapid, and the wind gusts will help uh, temperatures only reach the mid to upper 60s. It'll keep them pretty low for now. 35 mile per hour wind gusts are expected. But a warm up into next weekend or this weekend. Lots of sunshine and into Monday as well. Mid 80s for the high. But Monday night, we're going to see a chance of showers, a slight chance though. That could last into Tuesday morning, but not a, a big washout expected. And a cold front staying to our north will mean temperatures will only reach the upper 70s for the rest of the work week.